This video will show you how to change the exhaust manifold gasket on a 2002 E350 5.4 liter V8. Brought to you by That'll Do Engineering, working just hard enough to not get fired. The tools you will need for this job are a floor jack and jack stand, a metric socket set as well as a few metric wrenches, extensions, every wobbly socket extension, flexible socket wrench extension thingy that you have, and a scraper uh, for scraping off the gasket. You will be crawling around underneath your vehicle, so safety glasses are recommended, as well as proper footwear. Another optional tool is a book to read while turning those hard to reach bolts one quarter turn at a time with a wrench. Another useful tool you may need is an assortment of colorful language to use when you smash your knuckles. May I suggest fooey, shucks, drat, shiitake mushrooms, Son of a mother trucker. Step 1. Jack up your vehicle, support with a jack stand, and remove the wheel. You may also want to remove the doghouse on the inside of the truck to gain access to the top of the manifold and give you a little more light. Step 2. Remove the four upper bolts from the exhaust manifold. Three of them are relatively easy. The back bolt is difficult to reach and may require usage of your book to read or the colorful language. Step three, remove the two exhaust flange nuts. This may require a breaker bar because these bolts can be quite tight. Step four, remove the four lower manifold bolts. Two of these are fairly easy to get to. One is moderately difficult to get to, and the far forward bolt is nearly impossible to get to. Good luck. Now would be a great time to remind you to disconnect your battery before setting your truck on fire. Step 5, remove the manifold. It's a tight fit, but it will squeeze out when you push the exhaust pipe out of the way. Step six, clean all mating surfaces on the engine block and the manifold. Then reinstall the manifold with the new gasket. Congratulations on installing your new exhaust manifold gasket. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to press that subscribe button for more helpful videos.